hey guys so welcome back to my youtube channel it's your baby girl AE. so today we are going to be reviewing the series dear diane it's a diane Rossetti movie and a premiere january 24 2024 and i mean this is me i have been waiting for recording for the past two years and i i was just hoping that by now it should have been out but i mean so they got something new for us so today talking about dear diane and i mean i think when i first saw the comment soon i'm like okay what's this going to be about i was thinking that diane russell was going to be the main cast of the movie but i mean she shocked us all and it's been amazing for the past years that she keeps giving us um series that has been mind-blowing so this is dear diane this series okay so starting by um if you've i don't know if you've ever heard of anything um love at first listening because this is just what it is but before we go into that we have a producer as abdul tijani ahmed and diane rosset and the script is written by abdul tijani and ulu yude i mean abdul was one of the writers for and producer for um recording so it's going to be amazing seeing him do his thing here as well. It's He's very good at what he does. So, we have cast as Tetola Jones and we have um, Shams Garuba. Th those are like the main um, cast and characters of this series. So, the series started um, amazingly well when Tetola was talking to her friend on the phone and her friend was a brother. The person of Temi Dayo. And he got talking and Tetola, she's a painter, she paints. So, at the very first time she heard from Garuba that in person of Tolkan, it was, it was, it was, you know, when you're mes mesmerized about something, that's how it felt for her. And she was, she was glad, but at the same time, because she knows the history of the um, anchor or the owner of the podcast she was listening to, she just felt some kind of way. And she, she told her friend, Tell me that you about it. And told her to listen to it but i think she just kept dwelling in and she decided that okay let me call let me give him something that obviously he needs to so why this series is a bit sad for me is because we all know that okay the, the main cast is sick and we don't know how long he has to leave and all that so it's just it's a very it's more like a love and sad story at the same time i'm just trying to see where it goes because as of this moment they, they just have three episodes and I'm just trying to see where he, where how long it's going to be. But from what I'm saying, there's a bit of twist and turn. When you when you get to watch it, you know what I mean by that. There's like a, a very weird relationship between the auntie and the cousin. It's very weird. I just I really want to know the forbidden story about that. So, but mainly this story is more about the anchor of the podcast and his love at first listening so the love story begins from so i'm just hoping to see where it all leads to and how happy they're going to be at the end and if everything or the entire situation turns out but we still don't know um what's wrong with him we don't know exactly what the sickness is all about but we're just hoping that the story gets to open up as the episodes or the season goes so for now they're just in season one and we are hoping we get i mean we get good stuff from diane Russell. so it's not going to be um something different but i'm just hoping to see where this series goes and uh, i want to see where their love story goes and yeah the love story and the forbidden love story as well at the same time and i just see how friendship goes it's just that what he does is just making people open up and i know for some people if you haven't if you want to know who tedala jones is if you have seen omoni obolis um new movie that came out not the plan yeah she's the main cast there with um what's the name saga from big brother ninja i can't remember the season but yeah she's the one so this period is as if she's she's on the roll like you understand but guys try and watch this i can't rate it right now because i'm still trying to see how the story unfolds and how we're going to love it at the end but for now it's something it's a great start a great stuff and everything seems realistic okay guys um please don't forget to like comment subscribe and share thank you so much have a great day try and see their diary it just started you will get it bye